Hi, I'm Ryan Kleckner. I'm a former Special Operations Sniper and the best-selling author of the Long Range Shooting Handbook. And I want to talk to you about some shooting positions in the field. Now, when you're zeroing your rifle or you're at the range, most likely you're going to get in the most stable position possible. That's either going to be a bench or my preferred position, shooting in the prone. But when you're actually out in the field, getting in the prone isn't very practical all the time because you're going to have obstacles in the way that are going to keep you from seeing the target. You're going to have grass or rocks or logs that you have to get up higher to be able to see over. Now the problem with that is, the higher the rifle gets off the ground, the less stable it's going to be. So we need to find a happy medium of high enough to see, but not so high that we're not stable. I think a great position to use in the field is the kneeling position. Now when I use any type of unsupported position, meaning not on the actual ground or on a bench, I really want to use my sling. The sling is not just an accessory on your rifle to sling it over your shoulder, it's actually a shooting tool you're going to use for more stability. So to use a sling, you take your support arm and push it all the way through the sling. You wrap your arm around once and back to the rifle. Now when the sling is adjusted to the right length for you, there should be enough tension in the sling that it helps hold the rifle into your shoulder. To demonstrate this, I can torque the sling a little bit and you can see how the rifle pulls back into my shoulder tighter. That shows you the tension that's happening there. Now the kneeling position, if you have nothing else you're resting on and you're going to be using your own knee for support, you're going to want to sit on your shooting side foot. You can either be in a high kneeling, like this position, where I'm actually sitting on top of my heel and my support foot is in close to my body, or for some more stability, I can get a little bit lower by turning my foot sideways and sitting on the side of my foot. And now, if you notice, my support knee is too high, so I need to move my support foot out a little bit to lower my knee to get me back to level. When you're placing your elbow on your knee, don't put the tip of your elbow on your knee or you'll move around too much. Get your elbow a little past your knee for a little better support. And if you use your sling and you use this position, you'll see how much stability you can actually have. Now, the trick here is you've got to practice this. After you've zeroed your rifle at the range, get off the bench, get out of the prone, and start practicing using a position that you're more likely going to use in the field.